Hello, I'm Daniel Watrous, and in this short video I'm going to show you how to integrate the opt-in crusher with MailChimp, the MailChimp email service. So let's start off by looking at the opt-in crusher. When you log into your blog, this is the dashboard, and you want to go down to your settings menu and click on opt-in crusher. Scroll down until you get to the area that says opt-in form details and you'll see that there's an area where you paste the form generated by MailChimp and a big process form button. So now we go over to MailChimp and after you log in you see your dashboard and what you want to do is click the lists tab. From the lists tab you see a, a listing of each of your email lists and for each of those there will be a link that says forms. So next to the list that you want people to sign up on from your opt-in crusher footer you click on the forms link and then right up at the top link to subscribe form or create embed code for small form. You want to click on create embed code for small form and then we're going to make a couple of little adjustments. We're not going to include a form label and we're not going to include a required field notice and we're not going to include the format options. Those are the only values that we need. So we just need the email address itself. Now, if you wanted to include name, uh, then you would update your list to have that as a, a field. Or you could say include all fields, and it'll ask for first name, last name, and, and email address. After you get this where you want it, you'll notice there's a copy and paste into your website uh, form down here. So what you want to do is select everything in this box and copy it and come over and simply paste it into this field where it says paste your opt-in form. You click process form and that whittles it down to exactly what you need for the opt-in crusher and then you update and when you come back you'll notice now here's your MailChimp web form. Anybody who types in their email address here and clicks subscribe will be subscribed to your MailChimp email list. Hopefully that was helpful. Thanks.